Good afternoon. We are uh, delivering this uh, joint statement on behalf of France and Mexico. More than one in four people in Ukraine have now been displaced by the war of Russia against Ukraine. There are almost five million refugees and 7.1 million internally displaced persons. 90% of refugees and displaced persons are women and children. The risk of humanitarian trafficking is high. That's why our two countries requested a briefing of the Security Council with the International Organization for Migration and the UN Refugee Agency to discuss the situation of refugees and displaced persons. We believe we have a collective responsibility to protect and to bring assistance to refugees and displaced persons without any discrimination. We fully support the efforts of IOM and UNHCR and other humanitarian actors to provide assistance and organize the return of third country nationals. And we must also increase our efforts to combat human trafficking. Those France and Mexico will remain fully mobilized in this regard. As a consequence of this war, civilians have been killed, including children, humanitarian and medical personnel, and journalists for almost two months. According to WHO, there have been 136 attacks on healthcare facilities. This means that Ukraine accounts for more than 68% of all attacks on healthcare worldwide since the start of the year. These crimes will not remain unpunished. The first priority remains an immediate cessation of hostilities and full respect of international humanitarian law. The protection of civilians is an absolute imperative. Humanitarian access must be urgently guaranteed. We must spare no effort to achieve these objectives. In this regard, we fully support the call of the Secretary General for a four-day Holy Week humanitarian pause. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.